Hello family and friends. Today I bring you a reaction video from D Mwango. My mom always warned me, but I didn't listen. The end. D Mwango, congratulations. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Patience being to like, share, comment, and always drop something to promote and improve this channel. Tell us what you like, what you don't like, and your best video so far. Thank you. Now, I want to appreciate D. Mwango's mother so much. She's such a great mother. She's somebody who is worth hoping in. She has always followed her daughter from day one. I've been listening to them and I always enjoy the pieces of advice she always renders to her daughter. A mom's involvement helps go a long way in teaching the child. It allows the child to perform well in every sphere of life. It also establishes their confidence and ability. Can you imagine this woman is abreast with all the videos that D Mwango has made to date, including her relationship with G, JB or whoever. <laughs> yeah, JB. That's interesting, mom. Aside your busy schedules, you find time to know what happens to your daughter. This is a woman worth emulating, and she deserves to be in the Guinness Book of Records. These are some little, little things I believe women of these days lack. A mother has a great role to play in every endeavor of her children's life. I like the advice she gave above all. She said, D, you need to be patient. She was not even speaking to D anymore. You need to be patient in, in everything. You need to allow God to preside over everything. That's me paraphrasing what this woman said. She never moves a step without God. Mommy, God bless you. God bless you for always speaking to the entire world, the entire generation, the entire youth who are always in a hurry to move into a hasty relationship. D, you have seen it, you have tasted it, you have tried it, and I know you can testify that it didn't go well with you. There is no haste in life, there is no rush in life. And for those who always say that some time is ticking or what time is ticking, be patient in every relationship. See, if you rush, you always make a mistake. And as mommy says, it is only God who gives the right choice of partner to each and every one of us. Let us always seek the face of God in our relationships. The master originator of our lives. God. God Almighty, the creator, the supreme being. The one who knows our beginning from the end. Thank you, D, for sharing. I would want to have a voice in this. That it is very, very necessary for mothers and I should say parents, to have meaningful interactions with their children. Explain to your children what will happen before, during and after the happening of every transition. Plan ahead with them, develop required skills, and use transitions as conversational pieces that will help reduce the overall stress of your children. Mothers are encouraged to provide extra affection such as hugs and reassuring words. But look at um, an embracing mom and how she draws her daughter to her side, always giving her words of assurance, words of encouragement. If she is 
has made a mistake, she says it as it is. Don't cover up mistakes. Let them know where. Let the children know where they fell short. Making yourself available to support your child or your children can give him or her lots of assurance. And definitely, knowing that they, you give them lots of assurance, they will always run to you for better advice. Now, if in, in saying this, you ask yourself, how can parents be involved in their child's development? Children can be involved in their child's development in a number of ways. One, be a good role model. Two, love your child. To show them love through actions such as hugs, spending time with them, and listening to them. Thirdly, be a safe haven. Children raised by parents who respond consistently will have a better social and emotional development. Also, talk with your child as this helps their brain integrate. When different parts of the brain are integrated, they function harmoniously and leads to more cooperative behavior and more empathy. With this, I leave you, and thanks for watching. Cheers.